God loves it when we acknowledge and confess our sins. Welcome to today's DDRX. Our anchoring scripture is Deuteronomy 30, 19. I call heaven and earth as witnesses toward today against you that I have set before you life and death, blessing and cursing. Therefore choose life that both you and your descendants may live. The prescription is check your choices, especially in this unprecedented time. I want to look at Peter and Judas. We we'll see repentance versus regret. God loves it when we acknowledge and confess our sins. God does not want us to cover our sins. Mistakes are going to happen in our day-to-day -day living, but we must not overlook them in our relationship with God. We must own up to our fault and ask God for forgiveness. Proverbs 28, 13, He who covers his sin will not prosper, but whoever confesses and forsakes them we have mercy. See, God's mercy triumphs over judgment. In 1 John 1, 8 to 10, if we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. If we confess our sins, He is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. If we say that we have not sinned, we make Him a liar and His word is not in us. You see, Peter denied Jesus three times. He repented. He was remorseful. He felt sorrow for his action. He made a U-turn, a 180-degree turn to God and surrendered his life totally to God. Luke 22, 62. So Peter went out and wept bitterly. But you see, Judas, Judas also betrayed Jesus. He regretted his action, but he chose not to repent. He allowed Satan to get into his heart and he committed suicide. Matthew 27, 3 to 5, Then Judas, his betrayer, seeing that he had been condemned, was remorseful and brought back the 30 pieces of silver to the chief priests and elders, saying, I have sinned by betraying innocent blood. And they said, What is that to us? You see to it. Then he threw down the pieces of silver in the temple and, and departed and went to hang himself. Choose repentance. God bless.